welcome once again guys so guys uh, welcome in the section of uh, cyclicity question and answer session question and answer session of the cyclicity problems okay so I have discussed the cyclicity how you can find out the cyclicity of a number so right now I'll discuss the problems okay so before going our next stage uh, let me write down the cyclicity of 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 and 10 okay the cyclicity of 1 that is 0 2 cyclicity is 4 3 is 4 4 that will be 2 and 5 is to 1 6 is to 1 7 is to 4 8 is to 4 9 is to 2 and 10 is to 1 okay so guys our first question that is C twenty one up to twenty one the power of twenty one and twenty two's power twenty two and twenty three's power twenty three and twenty four's power twenty four okay so you have to calculate the unit place here so guys think about uh, thirty seconds and solve by yourself okay if you are able to solve this question then that is amazing for you in the 60 30 seconds okay but I'll tell you how you can optimize your time in solving this question in 15 seconds only okay so do it now and uh, I'm solving it from my way okay see now again continue the video don't pause it see this is your unit place this is your unit place and this one is your unit place and this one your unit place okay so this is your power this one it's your power okay so divide the power divide power by only 4 because 4 is the highest cyclicity in all the number in few numbers 4 4 here 4 here 4 here 4 okay if you are dividing the power with 4 that is the highest cyclicity if you are getting the remainder that is 1 then power will be 1 if you are getting the remainder 2 that the power will be 2 if you are getting the remainder 3 it will be the power will be 3 if you are getting the result and uh, that is the remainder 4 if the power will be 4 because you can't get the result that is 4 because it will again 4 by 4 it will be 0 that means if you are getting the 0 as a result then the power will be 4 this is your remainder and this is your power okay so guys uh, let's solve this problem okay apply the same strategy that uh, I've discussed here so <coughs> 21 that is the power divide by 4 it will be 1 remainder so the power will be 1 so this is the unit place 1's power will be 1 again multiply and this is the 22 so 22 divide by 4 it will be 2 remainder so the power will be 2 so 2's power will be 2 and again that is 23 so divide 23 by 4 it will be 3 remainder so the power will be 3 is 3 is the unit place and the unit place power it will be 3 and again that is the 24 so divide 24 by 4 it will be 0 remainder okay no remainder in this case so if there is no remainder in that means the power will be 4 so unit place that is 4 and the power will be 4 see guys 1 is to 1 that is 1 and 2 is to 2 that is 4 and 3 is to 3 that is 27 and 4 up to 4 it will be 216 then only write the unit digit it will be 6 okay then multiply all the unit places 1 into 4 into 27 it you take the unit place it will be 7 into 6 okay so your result will be 7 into 6 it will be 42 okay 
42 into 4 it will be 8 okay so 8 will your unit place okay if you solve this tedious calculation then you will get the unit place that is 8 okay so this is the basic fundamental and guys uh, let's solve some more problems here so let me rub this board okay next question guys find the unit place find the unit place question that is 18 power 18 into 28 power 28 into 2 double 8 power up to 28 okay so you have to calculate the unit place what will be unit place thing guys solve it yourself as previously that uh, I've told you some basic fundamental about the cyclicity so solve yourself and uh, now I'm solving right now see this is your unit place this one your unit place and this one your unit place so write unit place here 8 into 8 into 8 okay now what will be the power this is the power 18 so 18 divided by highest cyclicity that is 4 so it will be 4 times and remainder will be 2 so if you are getting the remainder 2 that means the power will be 2 okay and in this case that is 28 28 divided by 4 it will be 7 times and there will be no remainder if in such cases if you are getting no remainder then the power will be 4 okay and again that is 8 8 88 okay so in the case of 88 the remainder will be 0 that means again power will be 4 okay so guys 8 uh, 8 power 2 that is 64 and 8 is to power 4 it will be approx uh, 4096 so the unit place will be 6 and so let me write down whole number and I'll optimize again and 8 is to power 4 it will be again 4096 so only multiply the value of unit place 4 into 6 into 6 okay 4 into 6 into 6 you will get a unit digit that is 4 okay so it's valued your answer okay now guys let's discuss one other example so guys basic steps are uh, like uh, that that is the power divide power by 4 if you are getting the remainder 1 power will be 1 if you are getting the remainder 2 power will be 2 if you are getting the remainder 3 then power will be 3 if you are getting the remainder 0 then the power will be 4 ok so this is the basic fundamental now guys let's discuss next example that is question number 3 uh, in this question also you have to find the unit place ok see 17 is to power 17 into 27 is to power 27 and 37 is to power 37 ok so first of all this is your unit places values and this one your powers 37 27 and 17 now divide first power with 4 so it will be 4 uh, 4 the 16 and 1 will be remainder so 7 is to power 1 and 27 is will be 4 6 is a 24 3 will be remainder so 7 is to power 3 and again 37 up to 37 it will be divided by 4 it will be 9 times so 1 will be remainder 7 is to 1 see 
7 is to 1 that is 7 and 7 is to 3 it will be 3 4 3 so write only unit place that is 3 and again 7 so multiply all the digits okay so it will be 49 49 into 3 it will be 9 3 is a 27 then the unit bill unit place will be 7 okay so guys you have to only calculate the unit digit unit place will be 7 okay and now guys let's discuss one more example suppose 4 is to power 69 into 6 is to power 5 you have to find out the unit place okay so do one thing divide this power by 4 and divide this power by 4 okay and uh, this is your unit place this is your unit place 4 is to power 69 divided by 4 it will be this is the odd number and it will be uh, 1 times so 2 remaining and uh, it will be 29 it will be 7 times and there will be only 1 remainder so the power will be 1 and uh, divide 5 by 4 it will be 1 so the power of 6 it will be 1 so 4 into 6 that is 24 and the unit place it will be 4 okay so guys uh, if a question is asking like you have to calculate the unit place then you can easily calculate the unit place if you know the cyclicity pattern okay so guys thanks for watching this video and uh, if you have still any doubt any query then do comment do comment okay and uh, if you have uh, any question then you can mail us our email id that is current affairs funda at the red gmail.com this is our email id you can send your queries on our email id okay so thanks guys for watching this video have a nice day